my name is Stacy McDaniel and I'm from Monroe, Louisiana in the United States. And I just recently kind of got into anime. I say recently, probably in the past few years. Um, and then just started kind of collecting stuff after that. So I think what made me start collecting was like I said, I just got, I started anime probably two years ago and I loved it. And so I just wanted that little piece of the anime to stare at after it was over, kind of in my room. It just makes me happy. <laughs> so for my collection, I have, I think maybe 70 plus, but they're mainly smaller, one eight scale, one six scale, stuff like that. Um, I have, I've recently fell in love with kind of real action heroes Medicom got some um, just PVC smaller like I said probably the 1 8 scale is mostly what I have I have some Tokyo Ghoul stuff some Gintama uh, some Naruto it's I've got quite a few different things darker than black just a variety can't answer how much I think I've spent collectively um, I don't even know probably more than more than I want to think about. I used to have like an Excel sheet <laughs> that I would keep track of it, but I haven't logged some of my latest. The a la carte one is really going to push it up there. <laughs> He's going to be definitely the most expensive that I have in my collection. <laughs> um, on pre-order, right now, maybe, maybe five, perhaps, on pre-order. So, Favorite statue that I've seen, um, that's that's hard. If, if we talk about Diorama, it's really close between, I think, these two from Figurama, like the, the Tokyo Ghoul and Alucard are amazing to me. Um, other, other than that, like I would say uh, the ones I own would probably be, oh gosh, that's difficult. Um, maybe, Maybe my Gintoki figure from Gintama is just, I love that character. I still have it. I bought a Sebastian from, uh, from Black Butler. I got it in though and lo and behold, it was a bootleg. <laughs> so, so I can honestly say that's by far the worst. I mean, you, you can clearly see the quality difference, but I haven't had the heart to actually throw him away though, so I've still got him. Dream license. Um, I would like one of my favorite animes is Darker Than Black and there's hardly anything out there like the one figure from Metacom that I have I think is one of the rare figures so I would love to see some additional figures from that line. So when I first found Figurama I'd seen some some pictures on one of the figure sites that I go to it was some pictures of Vash and so I was like wow that's and I don't even watch I haven't seen that one yet. So I went out though because it was really nice and I looked and saw the Thor figure also and I also don't follow that one and it was but is very impressive pieces and then later we had sneak peek come of Alucard and that really piqued my interest so I've been kind of following much more closely after that then the devil man one was just I mean it was amazing especially after seeing some of the the actual shots of people unboxing that figure it's really really impressive i would like to thank figurama for for bringing me out here this is i don't even have words it's just beyond amazing to get this opportunity and get to see everything is just just wow what a, what a company <laughs> that's outstanding